Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and back to another Black Desert Online video. Today we're going to be taking a look at a pretty good spot to grind during the season that's not as crowded as some of the other places. And it's a really dense area, packed full of mobs. It's a great place to farm up that ore and time-filled blackstones for your seasonal characters. Now the spot that we're going to be looking at is the Fadus Habitat. It is a 120 to 190 AP zone. I grinded out here with like 164 AP and had no trouble at all taking the mobs down pretty efficiently. There is a ton of loot out here from Blackstones, you know, Bears and Uriah weapon boxes. You do get some Kaffir stones and occasionally some Mansion Voodoo dolls. But the main reason that I like grinding out here on a seasonal character is because it's so dense you get a ton of time filled black stones some tovova ore the uh, refined magical black stones as well as the grave robber appears pretty often out here and so you can get some guaranteed drops from him as well now this place is located northwest of grana and the node manager is the loopy tree forest now the node manager out here does have some daily quests for you for some rewards, some Kaffir stones, and he will also have the, I believe, weekly quest to kill 5,000 of them to get the big payout of ores or black stones, you know, whichever you choose. Now with the density out here, there's a ton of different rotations you can do. The one that I'm doing in the video is by far my favorite. It's the first one on the left that you'll come to if you're coming from Grana. I call it the back left, right rotation if you're coming from the node manager. Now what makes this place really useful as far as getting the uh, time-filled blackstones and ores is when you're grinding out here, and I'm not sure if it's triggered by a number of mobs killed or just a random event, but the Fadus supplies will show up with their special guards. Now when you kill the guards, you can destroy the supplies. And on the normal server, it usually just gives you like a crap ton of black stones. But on the seasonal server, it will give you the time filled black stones or refined magical black stones, the crystals that you can exchange for rewards, which makes this a really nice spot to come and grind because you never know when you're going to get that bonus and it'll really pump up the amount of ores and black stones that you're getting per hour for grinding out here. And it's also not one of the, you know, higher end spots um, that recently got revamped or one of the spots that's labeled on the uh, time filled or excuse me the magical black stones or whatever they are so there's not as many people out here i did run into a few people while i was out here grinding but it wasn't nothing bad the silver per hour out here isn't that great there's definitely better places to get the silver but the skill point or experience and combat experience out here is pretty decent so it's not a bad place to come and grind and on a seasonal character, it's really easy to get the AP requirement to come out here. I mean, I did it with duo weapons and pry accessories, so it's pretty simple to get that, pretty quick to get that, so you can grind out here early on to really stock up on your supplies. Well, guys, that's going to wrap it up for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Feel free to leave a comment, hit the like button for me, and look forward to more content. You guys take it easy, and I will see you next time.